Hi everybody, I hope you've been having a good week so far. I have some new things to share, so here we go. I did order some things off of Amazon, and uh, while, <laughs> while that was on its way, the kids wanted to go to Half Price Books, so I'll show what I found there. These three items I got at Half Price Books. So, this book here, The Element Encyclopedia of Magical Creatures. I just could not not get it. <laughs> so this should be fun. And then I also picked up this Crystal Healing book and card pack. Um, I was interested in finding a crystal deck and since this was a half price thing I thought cool yeah I'm gonna pick it up but it was still it was new but it was still fairly inexpensive I, I want to say these were under seven dollars so this one let's see if I open it up and show you so like here's the deck and then it comes with this book the only thing is the book is like attached so you can't maybe that's a good thing <laughs> I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing I think it's cool the way it's all packaged together and then I got this one the rune oracle book and card pack read the secrets in the language of the stones and so this will be cool because I am interested in writing excuse me, I am interested in runes, and I do uh, enjoy monthly readings that combine runes with tarot, and uh, so my daughter gave me her runes, she never did get into them, so oops, so here we go, you can see about the size of the deck you're going to get in these things, so if you have half price books, you're interested in these sorts of things, uh, say go check them out. All right, um, let me move this out of the way. I'll be right back. Okay, so from Amazon, I got some new decks, some new books, some new oils, and um, oh, two packages of those roller balls. So I've already gone through the ones I had. The essential oils I got were are galbanum, which I'm not positive, but I think I was inspired to try this from Shakti Shaman. Her channel is excellent if y'all haven't been there yet. I also picked up some sandalwood essential oil. I don't believe I had any sandalwood essential oil. This spike nard I was inspired to pick up and try out from the lovely Maha's treasure box. And then I decided to go ahead and get some violet. There have been several times I wished I had violet. And I didn't, but now I do. Okay. <laughs> so let's see. I picked up the book Practical Magic because the movie is one of my favorite movies. And it makes me think of my sister and I growing up in many ways. And in this case, I'm glad I saw the movie first, because you know when you read the book, sometimes the movie doesn't match up to how you imagine it in your head. So now I'm really enjoying the book. This arrived yesterday, and I've gotten a little ways through it. I think that's the first chapter. It's not a very big book. But I am really glad that I have it, and I'm enjoying it. This book I saw recommended on Vicious Lady 1340's channel. Uh, if y'all have not looked at her book tour, I definitely recommend it because she has really interesting book collection and um, has a lot of great recommendations for people. So this is Wart Cunning for Demonolatry by S. Connolly, a formulary for the demonolater, alchemist, and gardener. And I, as you see, have been... I haven't read it that far. I've just skipped around and marked things I want to go back and look at more. And then I'm going to go through the whole book. 
I'm reading this book while I'm also looking through this book, which I am loving, loving, loving. But that's not part of the haul. Okay, so then <laughs> I also picked up this book, Night of the Witches. Folklore, let's see, Folklore, Traditions, and Recipes for Celebrating Walpurgis Night. So, um, I've been, this book has been on my list for a while, and I meant for it to be here before spring arrived, but that's okay, it's still, it's still good, and I'm happy to have it. And then I also picked up Let's see, I saw this book recommended, I think, on L. Jacob's channel, along with this tarot deck. This tarot deck is The Wizard's Tarot by Corrine Kenner. And I've already been looking at the book and looking through the cards, and I'm already falling in love with this deck, and I'm glad to have it. And, um... If y'all are interested, I'll do a look through of the deck and give my first impressions. And I also recommend going out and checking Elle's video on this as well because she did a really good video too. And then, sorry, my son's mowing. I hope that's not going to mess up the video for anybody, but I'm going to carry on. So, uh, Tarot and Astrology. This book is uh, oh, Tarot and Astrology, Enhance Your Readings with the Wisdom of the Zodiac by Corrine Kenner. And this book looks fascinating. I saw this and thought, yes, I must have it. And I, I feel like somebody else recommended this book to me, but I just it's escaping my mind right now who it might be. Okay. And then finally, 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 I got the Thoth Tarot, and I got it, it arrived yesterday, and I started working with it last night, before these books arrived, these books didn't arrive till today, and I'm already in love with that deck, I'm already in love with it, uh, Kelly over at The Truth and Story is doing a series of videos on that deck, and those are very good, of course, and, um, I really resisted getting that deck for quite a while and then finally I would just decide I was ready and I ordered it and I was super excited when it got here and I've been excited ever since. So the books I got to go along with it are The Ultimate Guide to the Toth Tarot. Um, I'm trying to think. Maybe this was the book recommended on Elle's channel, and I saw that tarot and astrology book on somebody else's channel. Shoot, I try to remember these things so y'all can go see everybody's videos, but um, maybe this was the book I saw on her channel. Somebody tell me. Uh, this book looks really good, and I'm glad that I have this book to start working with. And then my second choice for a book to go along with that deck is of course uh, Lon Milo Duquette's book because if you watched any of my book videos at all you know I'm a huge fan of his and of course quite interested in what he has to say. I have another book by Duquette that's on the magic of Aleister Crowley and that was a very interesting book. So yeah those are the two books I'm going to work with and I've already barely start on that one because it just arrived today and I was busy looking at the other deck okay um let's see oh well I have the decks let me just show you those real quick <laughs> okay so here's my Thoth deck and I got the size that comes in the blue box and I am not keeping the box I'm going to have a special way that I want to store this deck in particular and before the deck arrived, I had the urge to really bond with this stone. This is a Smoky Elestial with anhydros in it. I don't think I'll be able to catch the anhydros on camera, but um, yeah, I'm quite sure I won't. 
be able to show it on camera. But anyway, this is the stone that I, I wasn't sure why all of a sudden I just felt the urge to pick it up and really just start working with it about a week before the deck arrived and then when it arrived yesterday I just felt like I wanted to have this stone with this deck and really work with them together and I don't do that with all my decks I don't um, necessarily have specific stones that I keep with my other decks as a matter of fact I don't think I have any other decks currently with stones on them sometimes I'll do that pre-charge a deck with a stone but um no, right now, this is the only one. I'm not sure why I feel that way, but I'm going to go with it. And then this is the, uh, the Wizard's Tarot deck. This deck, I love it. It's not my normal type of artwork because, um, well, first of all, here's the back, which is beautiful to me. And then the imagery on the cards is photo manipulation for the most part. And here's the initiate, which would be like the full card. And she's starting off her journey at the Mandrake Academy. And um, anyway, this deck. Oh, well, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> I'll show it to you later. It's quite slippery, and I'm not ready to show anything in the deck yet. All right, so. That's what I got. This deck, that deck, the books and the oils. And that's enough, don't you think? I guess so. So I'm going to go ahead and end this one here and hope that everybody is having a great week and looking forward to a wonderful weekend. And as always, I thank you for joining me and I wish you many blessings and I will see you soon. Bye.